All right, what is going on, guys? Today we are watching Haikyuu to the Top, Season 4, Episode 21. Uh, nothing to say before the start of the episode, but as always, if you like the video, make sure to drop a like. And if you're new, subscribe to the channel. I'm really enjoying the engagement between everyone on the channel. And I was really happy with last week's uh, viewership and kind of views and people who were just chatting about the episode in last week's episode. So I'm looking forward to seeing the channel grow and look, I'm looking forward to seeing my subscriber growth grow. I'm going to do all I can to make that happen. And yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed my reactions. So, without further ado, let's get right into the episode right now. Hell yeah. Kageyama was on fire on the last episode. Mm, uh, like I said, you need to you need to not doubt Sue, Keith. I reckon he's got a plan. Let's get it. Episode 21, Hero. <laughs> this sounds like a good episode. Go on, Suki. I'm gonna hear it. He's just like, well, I want to do this. How do I do it? Hang on, let me practice. Ah, that's very true. That's a good point, yeah. I like that. Yeah, Suki's like, he, he understands us fully well. No problem. No problem. Ah, oh, the way he twists his body. See, he guided that to Daichi. It may not look like it, but Suki guided that to Daichi. Mm hmm He can work with that. Definitely. Ah, oh, I love that. Yeah. Guide the ball. You don't always have to stop it dead. <laughs> it's true. You know, you understand these things outside of the match, but when you're in there, you just kind of act on in instinct and you let your emotions get the better of you and you just have to go for the block if you think you can. <laughs> ah, I'm enjoying this. Ooh. It's a harsh realization. <laughs> oh, Suki, you little bitch, I love you. It was deliberate, hell yeah. He is a, not a robot, but he's a genius. We'll give him that. Hell yeah. Come on, Kinoshita. Go score 10 points. Hell fucking yeah. <laughs> I like how Yamaguchi's doing it too. Oh, this is so nice. His pinch server senior, I love it. Even though he's a second year, but you know what I mean. He didn't hear that. Ooh, he's so focused right now. That's nice. That's nice. It has a different way of focusing than Yamaguchi does. I love the dead quiet. Come on, Kinoshita. Come on. Please don't go out. Take it. Oh, no. Honestly, next one. Next one that he does is going to be fire. Honestly. I swear it's going to be it. It's going to be the one. It's going to be his moment. He did, didn't he? So did Tanaka. Oh, everybody's had such great moments. Yeah, he did. Oh, God, he needs his moment. I want him to have his moment. Oh. My dude's been been putting in work, though, in practice. Like, look, he's beefy as well, like the rest of the team. He's He wants this so bad. He wants it. Oh, bro, you're going to get it. Don't worry. He did. He did it. He did his job. It just wasn't enough. It's just the other team got it. You will. You really will. Hell no. Hell no. No way they'll be done. I hope not. I don't think so, though. Kageyama, Kageyama, Kageyama. Oh, boy, you nasty. You nasty. Who's this? Nishinoya? You were scared? You were a little scaredy cat when you were little? I don't really remember, but maybe it was up until I started grade school. Oh, birds and bugs! No, oh, I could not imagine this from someone like Nishinoya. Oh my god. <laughs> Previous life, like, there's no way this guy was scared of anything. I want to meet his grand- Ooh. Wow. Wow, okay. Wow. <laughs> okay, Nishinoya. I reckon you got it in you in these jeans. Let's go. Oh yeah, I bet he hasn't been scared of anything in a while. Yeah, that is so cool. That is so cool. Nishino is so cool. It's not like all, it's not like us normal people would understand that. Oh, here he comes, Mr. Pretty Boy. Come on, Nishino, you got this, bro. Oh, look at him. He's adorable. He's got the same fit as the grandpa from Ben Ten does. All right, I like that. That's a good grandpa right there. I don't know about that one. I'm 
Someone help him. It's okay to be helped. Legit. Nice! Good job! Of all the people in this show, seeing a new level of, like, growth from Nishinoya of all people is just... It's amazing, honestly. Of all the people that would need more character development, he, he's not at the top of the list usually, but wow. Yes. Nice. I love that. I love that. Hell yeah. He's got a foreign name. Oh, are these the twins? Oh my god, <laughs> they actually look like twins at this age. Oh, he's a setter. What? Oh, he started as a setter. I can't tell. Well, I can kind of tell which one's who, actually. <laughs> he's like, these, fuck these fucking twins. <laughs> Is this why they both do both then? Is this why they both set set and uh, spike? They are pretty cool. Setters are awesome. Oh, they've known each other like all end of a theory, little one. <laughs> Bet you Ursamu was a bit better than Atsumu. Oh. Okay. Hmm. What's the issue? Ooh. <laughs> oh. <laughs> he even speaks to his brother like that? <laughs> oh, I mean, it's a way to get him back up. <laughs> He's taking bitches. <laughs> Aaron's like, I've known these dudes for way too long. <laughs> well, they still sleep in bunk beds, that's cute. <laughs> yeah, they actually, they do really improve each other. The competitive, like, -ness just fuels them. It's true, they do have a lot of crazies in that camp, don't they? Someone who's a bit eccentric, and they can see us clear room for more growth. Oh, okay. Yeah, I can kind of see that, actually. Come on, Yamaguchi! Nice, bro. I'll, I'm loving Yamaguchi's form. Oh, that footwork. That footwork. God, he's good. He is so good. He's a little demon, Atsumi, to be fair. Yeah, at that angle, oh my god. The fact that he got that off in so well. He really doesn't pull punches. He's so good. More control. Mm. Hell yeah. I love that. He's like... Arrogant, I guess. But he's also really good. And he's really supportive of his teammates. It's like a lot like Oikawa. It's true, yeah. His physique really does help. That's true. That is really impressive, actually. I like this music. Hell yeah, Kagyama. Alright, so that was Season 4, Episode 21 of Haiku to the Top. That was a really cool episode. It was nice to see Atomu and Osamu's kind of growth from when they were children and how they've kind of bounced off each other to make each other better and more competitive. Uh, that's a really nice way to grow your competitive side, especially with someone who you're so close to. It's like how Kagyama and Hinata do it, I suppose. Um, and other kind of duos you see in the series do it, but it's a lot more closer and more personal between the two twins, I think. Because they are always trying to be better than each other, but they also make each other better. Uh, it's also nice to see that they knew Aaron from when he was younger as well. It was really funny um, to see how they first, like, saw him and how they saw his, like, oh, he's got a foreign name and stuff like that. That's cool. Uh, oh, I can't believe Atsumu is a demon. Like, he's actually so good. It's not even funny. And he's just... He's so, like, when he has the team that, like, has the potential, he will go all out to offer them the support that they need. That's, like, it's really cool to see. This is, like, a really well-made team, I think. Um, but, yeah, overall, a really good episode. I really enjoyed it. And, yeah, anyway, guys, I hope you guys enjoyed this episode. I certainly did. And I hope you guys enjoyed my reaction. 
Thank you guys so much for watching. Have a nice rest of your day and peace out.